Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, it's, it's it's definitely for the for the most part of recent, especially the the, the more high profile fights. It's definitely a big payday. Um, uh, you know, the likes of Jake Paul, Logan Paul, they bring a massive audience wherever they go. Doesn't matter what they he they could talk about doing uh, uh, entering a breakdance competition, and you'll see a lot of people watching and tuning into breakdance. That's just what you know. Uh, I have to you have to give them props in terms of the the, the fan base that they have created. Um, and again, now that everyone's kind of interested in combat, which is technically good, you know, it's, it's, it's a good deal for a lot of up and coming athletes. Uh, they could be headlining on a show and you have, you know, credible athletes underneath them that will now be seen by a uh, lot of new, new fans. And it's great for them. And like I said, it is definitely a payday. Um, in terms of like the opponents that are going over to, to, to fight, that's a different question. I feel like um, there could be better opponents, um, you know, a bit more. There's, I, I, f- I find there's a lot more MMA fighters that are, are, are better at boxing that could be going over and doing the same thing, but maybe not have the same, you know, make not, maybe not make the same noise or, again, because it's, it's all about numbers. So we'll see. Hopefully, um, you'll see a, a few more credible MMA fighters that are actually good with their stand-up as well that can go over and actually, um, actually make an actual impact. Thank you.